we back? Okay. Are we back in action? I've got to say that if this happened while I was doing this, I would just freak out. So I hope it's all good now. I think it's all good. You know yeah. what? Yeah. I didn't I have mean, my Wi-Fi. We don't want to sorry. point fingers. Yeah, but it was but it my wasn't. phone, no Wi-Fi. It so was... I'm hoping that this is okay. So then we'll test. Oh, that's much so better. So much better. Okay, so oh, now is my right, jacket. Hey, Wendy. Me. It was me. So now is my jacket right. better? Yeah, nobody's heard on our intro the fact that I mucked things up and didn't have Wi-Fi on. Wi-Fi's on again. It looks like Lauren's looking good now. And we should be much better. Yes, thank you, ladies. Okay, here, we're on. Okay, so now that this is a new vid... We're going to introduce so again. We're going to have to introduce again. I'm sorry. Okay. So, what we're giving you guys today is we're going to give you a bit of a snapshot of how to wear tone on tone. Because it's a very elegant look. It's a very stylized look. But when you're mixing different colours, even though they're tonal, it can be a little tricky to know what you can do. So we're going to do all that hard work for you and you can just take our yeah, word for it. I guess it's how to, you know, we often talk about, oh, how to look expensive. This is the art to really looking expensive with the, with the mix we have now. So tone on tone really has that that uh, elegance of, like Lauren said, of looking expensive. So. Fancy people. Because we are, we fancy are people, all fancy people. Like people. Us. Oh, no, just like us. Yeah. Yeah, just, ah, if you want to be fancy, <laughs> you've got to do this if you want to be a fancy uh, girl like us. Yeah, okay. Exactly. All right, hi the end, everyone. <laughs> hi, guys. Thank you for coming back. I know. No, I'm surprised. I'm surprised it was 4G was just a bit yucky. But as soon as we're connected to the Wi-Fi in here, for some reason it was off, we're back. Yeah, I don't so know why it's off. Yourself. My fault. Sorry. Okay, shall we get going? So this is how we look expensive, ladies. You'll love this. I'm sure you'll love it. Mm, absolutely. And you can see how we've got our colour groups because usually to look expensive, you need to pick a colour and stick to it in a way. At least for some of it, mm. some of the outfits. So we've got the ivory group and you're, did, were you saying that you're going to link it somehow? So oh yeah, Bron, Bron working from home today. Bron's going to... Um, Pop up, sorry, Bron, if you're not ready. Bron's going to up, put up a bunch of links and we're going to call this the Ivory Bundle because pretty much the way we're going to do it today... Capsule, bundle. Bundle, capsule, group, doesn't matter. Whatever something, word Bron feels like using today. Um, and she's going to actually do all the links. So especially for those, for those of you watching now, we're all besties at this point, but maybe for those watching later, which is where most people actually do watch, even though they're missing out on all the fun of the chat, but they that's are. okay. Yeah. We forgive you. You're having fun. Yeah. They're not. Okay. Maybe. Um, but they, so Bron's going to pop a link with all the links to this outfit because I think what is a little bit hard, you kind of, you might not actually know what goes with what if you're looking on a website, right? It's hard to see. It's that's hard to see. That's bundling it together for you. Exactly. It's a funny word when you say it like that. Just saying. Oh, okay? it's Joanne and Judy, mother and daughter. Oh, how nice. Oh, that's super cute. Just, just like us. Yeah. <gasps> totally. Nice to do something together, isn't it, ladies? Fast. And how fun watching a live together. I know. That's, that's fantastic. Really I think mean, we're doing I think together. every mother, grab your daughter and watch this, okay? Yeah. You tell them. Or your yeah. husband. Apparently a few hubbies are watching it. And oh, can, can, I, can I say what that one said? Yes. Yes, Because it was right. pretty funny. He said he actually likes seeing the camel toe. I like the camel toe sometimes. I had such a great laugh. I said, usually we like to give out the last, but he made me laugh. That was so fantastic. Funny. So I know. good on you. So any husbands out there, we're open to any of your suggestions. Yeah, that's yes, right. Yes, that's right. Oh, okay. Okay, Sonia, you have the snakeskin shirt. Gone. Oh, no, it's gone. Gone. Wore it one day, gone the next. What can I say? So when we say that we do have, I don't know how many times we've said this, probably never, we do have limited quantities on most of our stock. So you don't see it everywhere, ladies. You know, it's exclusive. We like to keep it exclusive. So when we say, you know, not much left, we mean not much left. <laughs> we actually left. mean about <laughs> three left. <laughs> That's right. We mean not like about hundred left. left. <laughs> like it. If you don't like it, don't worry. And we often don't repeat. You know, we often don't. I mean, occasionally we do when we want to change fabric or whatever, but it's never quite the same. It's always a little bit different. So you do have to get in there, ladies. All right, now okay, let's get started. Go. You might right. like something today here anyway. All right, so should we start? I feel like we need to just be starting with a pant. I know, so I'm out the pants exactly what I'm is this, I always start my outfit with a pant. Don't ask why. Okay, we're starting with the collot. You know how much we love, love the collot. This like is that, that beautiful swing, beautiful fabric. It has a belt to bring it in if you have a small waist. Great for pear shape, um, great for all those shapes. Don't worry, great for everyone. Just go for it, ladies. I think okay. it really does suit, what you're trying to say as well, is it probably does suit the hourglass, the straight or the pear shape. 
But if you are an apple shape and you don't like anything around your waist, we actually have a really great stretchy one, the herringbone one. Yes, which you can opt for. Which does not have a belt. Thank you for clarifying. It's the only difference. This does have a widest, a wide-ish waist. That's why we put the belt there. Well, come up close. That's why there's a. Oh, it's not very good, is it? We didn't put the lighting with that. We moved the lighting. I'm not quite sure if we did a good job with that, Lauren. Mm -hmm. No, let's see. Put that over this way. Okay. Um, yeah, so you can make that tighter if you want. So there is a bit of comfort there, and it's also, it also has a little opening V at the back, like a little, can you see that? Yes, you can. So it gives you more comfort when you put it on. Okay, it's enough of the comments. Oh, awesome. Okay, so we're saying that a pant, this pant, or a pant like this, I'm thinking any really loose baggy can like this, right. cop with this look, but and, technically and you probably, can do any pant. And probably any length as well, just something loose, yeah. that's really what we're talking yeah, about. Yeah, I think so. And also, okay. actually, we didn't rub this, but this pant does also come in ivory, oh, so that group. would look great with that group too. Yes, yes. Okay, so I'm going to start with our Sydney shirt isn't it? Yes. Yep. You do need to wear something under this. It is a wee bit transparent. Let's go up close. So you can see my hands through that. Just wear a cami, really, if that's all you need. And a it's white. a direct stripe through. It's a beautiful fabric. A white or a black would work. Yes, that's right. Mm. Well, I'd probably go black. It's not actually white. It's a bit ivory. So I'm maybe, a yeah, motto white. Yeah, yeah, like a motto white. We don't do stuff white. Yeah. 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 Yes. So you do that with a, I like it as a front tuck, and I think it looks best as a front tuck, because otherwise you tend to lose your definition of a waistline and your shape. So we do that tucked in there. And if you aren't wanting to do a front tuck, remember, anytime we say front tuck, you can also do side tuck. It's that just, goes without saying ladies, It's yes. hard to side tuck on Jane, our hair yeah, lady. That's right. So she's just always going to show you. Yeah, it's hard to tuck in general because there's no body in it. <laughs> in case you hadn't noticed, I know well, you're making so realistic you would never know, but there's not actually a body in this, it's just a <laughs> She goes through the, the ring of this chain now. I stupidly didn't undo this. Oh, oh so you're going to have to watch me undo. But this is our beautiful sleek cardi. It does have a nice sheen to the fabric and it's very, it's slinky but loose, you know, which is really nice. So I'm undoing these gorgeous buttons. There you go. Nice buttons. And pop that over there. It just gives you a bit of a casual vibe. Look at that. So I guess the point of this tone as well is you're doing neutrals. So it doesn't necessarily have to be all ivory or all brown, which also looks amazing. But this one in particular, you've got the print that's tying in all your neutrals. Yes, the, the, this is quite elevated with a mix of uh, different shades. Hang on to that and I might just throw some shoes in there. I love the long line cardi with the collots. That's the new look in my opinion. It is. Like. Love sneakers with it. I've got the pale pink there, but you can do white sneakers, and I kind of like these. <laughs> yeah, cute, Excuse me, really cute. With this. Amazing. Ah, I just got that on my toe. That hurt. Okay, gorgeous. Love that. So I really do. I do love a lot these days with a sneaker, though. Yeah, um, I think it's classy. something very classy about it. I'm going to just get, can you hold this for one sec? Yeah. I'm going to get your comments, because sometimes it just filters oh, it all. I have to click a button oh, yes. to. Yes. Oh, yeah, yes. Missing them, Actually, I can see. Actually, 15 comments. Yeah. There's a few there that we have to scroll through. Okay. Can you try the cardi on, please? Oh, Roma, you never ask. We'd love to try the cardi on. We can both try it on, in fact. I've got my armbands on today, so. Oh, you know that's a bit hard when we do this, isn't it, with the armbands? But you had to look perfect. You had to look good. Yeah, of course you did. All right. The main thing, looks before function, I say. Now, Karen, hi, Karen. We know Karen. How are you going? How are you going, I Karen? I am just going to put it out there so no one gets angry later. That I'm going to oh, say that all these items are going to be sold out by the time the shop's open. Forget it, Karen. I've got just to say. Saying, just saying. Just saying. Maybe you're not. selling too fast for that. If yeah. you love it, okay? Don't rush into it, but don't be disappointed when it's not there. That's all I can say. This is the card. just saying that we have very few quantity in any of these things. Looks great. Beautiful. Love it. Just hold any of these up at the same time. Actually, looks great with your outfit. I've been meaning to get this colour. I've got the I know, colour. It looks sensational on you. It looks fabulous with the pink. So, with a tone, you can always do your denim, obviously, but nice. I think this makes it look really funky. Gorgeous. Love that. And if you want a bit of a change from that blouse, we've also picked out the banana shade for you because that's again quite neutral. Then you're going to go your banana. Your black or your ivory pants, Ooh, it actually nice. doesn't matter, you can do either or. Looks good with your boots as well, but you can easily do sneakers. I'll show you with sneakers as well. These are quite smooth fabrics, so it won't bother coming right up front. And the banana here, 
as it turns out, quite strange, is perfect on the, our screen. So I'm assuming it's perfect on your, mm. when we've got three screens here, all the same. It's, um, yeah, it's very light and lemony. Very light and lemony. And along with that, we absolutely love this banana. Banana? You love that banana? This banana shade this banana. in the blouse. I love it with that with cake. this cake, which I think is an ivory cake. And look how sensational that looks. Looks really Again, nice. with that black collot, it looks so classy. I think this, this is, is the epitome of class, isn't it? Yes, it is. And I was going to say as well, I think what really works between these two is the, the ivory in this has a bit of a yellow undertone. Mm. Then you've got your blouse, which obviously has a yellow undertone. I think when they don't work tone on tone, if this had a blue undertone, it wouldn't work with the warm. Mm. Yeah, it right. wouldn't work with the warm shirt in general. So I think as long as you, if you want to do all different colours, let's come up close and show them the difference in these yes. colours. Yes, good idea. So see how they're very similar but they're different. Now a lot of people might think, oh, they're not going to match, it's not going to go. But because they've got the same, they both throw that yellow colour, that's when it really works. Right. You can also do your cape with this. So this, is your, this is your dressy night out when Mr, for the Melbourneers out there, when Mr Andrews lets us do something, this is what we're going to wear. And this ivory looks at, it still looks fantastic with this um, ivory cape. So you can see that it doesn't throw the yellow when you put a different it's, colour it's on it. It's quite a good match. It's going to look. And I think because your skin, because this shirt is sheer, see? your skin is going to come through. So it, it already, change. already puts that um, warm, it just, it just has that warm. I think it's not a very blue base and it's also got the brown through it. Yeah, it's gorgeous. So this is your fancy outfit and then your not so fancy outfit or your casual fancy outfit. Oh, we got blurry again. Oh, we have. You know what? So I think it's the area. Oh, well, it's not coming back later. Oh, okay. Well, I was going to show this. With what? With, with any of them. Okay. Well, we did it with this, but that's okay. So your cape is going to do your dressy look and then this is your more casual look if you want to wear it with a sneaker. Yes, yeah, so this is your more casual look. Then lastly, we can easily throw over um, another neutral vest if you just want to add some wow. So we'll show you some of those looks. I actually love a really, really chunky vest. Yeah, over something sheer like this. It's again that Parisian class that you that you'd see in it walking down the street in uh, Paris or any stylish city around the world, actually, maybe even New York. Look at that. I even oh, love so nice. And I've got to say, I would add these white boots to something like that. Yeah, really cute. Ooh, really nice. I love the length Gorgeous. of the dress with the baggy collot. So remember, we said we're not travelling, but we're doing it with our wardrobe. This is New York and Paris. Definitely. Love that. I like that. Me too. That vest is great. Do you want to put the vest on? I want to show everyone how good it looks on you. Okay. Now I'm cold. Can I put my jacket? You can put your jacket back on as long as it doesn't offend people. You could have left the card on. Maybe. Oh yes. So I don't look like ten ton Tessie. Look at that. As it turns out, I'm oh, great because cold. because it's got this slim line in the centre there yes. and the colour showing through. So it doesn't really matter how big that is. But if I was to do that, all of a sudden I'm. <laughs> <laughs> I look like a grizzly bear. No, no, do this. Yeah. This is the way to do it. You've got to do it like this, ladies, don't you? <laughs> Love that. It does have pockets. And I'd swan around, actually. I'd just do my There's something really, really, really I cool about that. Oh, we're back. I think the internet has fixed. I think it's the area. Yeah. We can't fix, can't fix that one, unfortunately. That's right. Did you? No, you don't need to try this on. Okay, no. I think we finished that bundle. What do you think? Yeah, so I think, so the key here is we've got a baggy pair of pants. Really, you can probably do, honestly, any colour. Ivory would look amazing, but I think it's important to show how black looks as well because everyone, I hope, has a good black pant in their wardrobe. If I, not, don't I, worry, we'll have one for you. If not, we've got one. Definitely beauty. consider that polite. That's not actually a classic pant. We're talking about an extra piece. You know, there is a basic thing that maybe we could uh, do another day, but what you have to do is really consider your special pieces, and these would be your special mm. pieces. Mm. Uh, Spain law and most schools. Oh, on hangers. Um, no, they're on hangers. My stores have our clothing on no, hangers. No, no, no. No, how you store your clothes. We, um, I oh, hang most of mine, yes. but all my knitwear, like what Faye's wearing, I never hang. I only fold. Okay, what I do, I have everything on a hanger except my knitwear, and I usually roll it up. Yeah, I roll it. Like a suitcase. In fact, as much as I can, I'll roll something up to avoid those pokey 
things here that yeah. you get with some hangers. Yes. But if the fabric is strong enough, I just put on a hanger. Like I'll never fold any other garment. Oh, I'm lying. I actually do fold my jeans in half as well. But they're okay because they're just jeans and they seem to be okay. Mm. Everything else I actually hang. Yeah, I hang. But I've got, more, I've got more hanging space than folding, folding space. space. Yeah. Actually, and all the knitwear too. takes up a lot of space in your drawers because mm. you can imagine how many drawers are happening at our house. We have a lot. Yeah, okay. we have a we few, have few a hundred drawers. So I find <laughs> knitwear takes up a lot of room. But if you do want to hang your knitwear, you need to get those really good hangers. Otherwise, you are going to get little points in the in the shoulder yeah but look if you do if, you, if there's a lack of storage space in your home wardrobe space that is take your husband's okay if you can't do that just consider how you would pack a suitcase in a way you don't have to press your garments again i think that is a good idea mm -hmm. it's a good trick that i i learned years ago because i traveled so much and it just i thought well if it works so well when i'm traveling why not do it at home but i do have a massive wardrobe just saying, I've had some kids that I've left home, I use their old wardrobes as well. So I have a lot of space. <laughs> All okay, right, done with the We're idea. done. So yeah, that's our um, ivory capsule. So Bron has already popped the links up. Now I'll mention as well that for those of you who aren't watching right now in real time, the description at the very top of this video is going to showcase all the links of everything here. Because I know that some people have been having some trouble finding um, garments yeah, we'll that we're see. talking about. So everything's roll. there. Okay, somebody wants to know how we roll. Okay, don't let, let's have a jump up. We'll do this one. Okay, we so roll then, differently. I roll like this. I fold it in half, like I'm about to fold it, right? So I do that. Then, sometimes actually I do that, but I, I won't. Oh, it's, got this, it's got the tag in here, yeah, so it's not going to be as good. Then I just start from the top. I'll just come a bit closer. Okay, excuse the tag because it's a big square. And I just roll it up. And then I just put it in the drawer like that. And the thing is that now when I open it up in three months' time, because I've got a lot of clothes, nothing gets to be worn that often. <laughs> She's not kidding. Then I just unroll. And then there's no creases. There's actually never a crease in the centre front. Although you do it differently again. Yeah. Well, I did find that some when I travel, I did find that crease in the front. So I've learned to do it a different way. What I do is grab both sleeves and fold them like so neatly and put the collar down or the neck down and I roll like this. Uh, excuse that tag again and it's like ends up being like a towel roll and I pack them sideways like in my drawer so sausages. I can see everything that's there. Like and, sausages. And I can fit heaps in and it kind of keeps them in a nice neat pile, nothing unravels and then I can just grab one when I need to grab it and then voila it comes out Perfect. I've Definitely. never had to steam or no. do anything with any of my garments. And, and I'm a, a bit of a fuss spot. And the other great thing is that you can actually see it all lying there. So because you've only got that little roll, you can see everything. Whereas I find when you're stacking knits on top of each other, you kind of don't see what's underneath. Yes, if they're folded on top of each other, you don't know what's going on. Mm. Yeah, that's right. All right, so, so Tanya's just asked if I can try that mince jumper on and that will bring us into, into this next capsule. Our newest capsule. It's a bit different to the one I'm wearing, but we do have this shape further down. All right, so this is a size 10 that I'm putting on. Oh, you got it. All right, so I'm five up. foot two. So this is how long it is on me. Personally, if I was going to wear it untucked, personally, I'd wear a pair of over-the-knee slouchy boots. Ooh, I think that would yes, look cool. Yes, that would look so but cool. But not everyone. That's very personal preference here. But otherwise, I will do. I'm just going to have a look in the mirror. Yeah, do I would do a bit of a loose, sloppy front tuck. Let it be half or a side tuck. That's right. Yeah, I that's how I wear mine yeah, as well. I definitely go for my normal size in this. It's really, really stretchy. No, it's generous as well. It's generous, but you go in the, the normal size because it needs to be generous. If you have that as a tight fit, it's just the wrong look, ladies. Yeah. I mean, I wouldn't say, like, it, it is generous, but I wouldn't say it feels generous. It feels like it's no, the it right size. It feels just right. But what I mean yeah. is you don't... I'll just demonstrate. You don't want it like that, okay? You want it like that. So you want it nice and loose. Yeah. And then you can just do a bit of a... Yeah, because otherwise that. it doesn't tuck so well. That's right. Yeah, like that. That's beautiful. Okay, so we're going to start with that. Okay, so we're starting with our mint green capsule. I'm going to put it on Jane hanger. Put Jane Jane together. And here we thought we'd grab our wrap pant because that looks sensational with a front tuck with this lady or... Uh, with this jumper, 
or a side tuck, gorgeous. I'd probably do it so that it comes up on the side where the skirt isn't. So you'd hang it down like that. So you can see what we mean about the skirt. See how there's that flap over the, oh, I'll get the front? I'll demonstrate a bit actually, see that? Camel toe cover. <laughs> Instant camel toe cover. Instant. Rosemary, this jumper was a 10 and I'm always a 10. So very standard sizing, super easy. That's right. All right, so we've got this. And you know what I love about this already? That we've sort of got a pant that's a bit more on the dressy side and then we've got a jumper which is a bit more on the casual side, combining yeah. the two. Yes, love mixing those two. Definitely. I mean, definitely like something dressy, like we're both wearing, I think something a bit dressy with something more casual. Such an elegant look. Mm. Anyway, with this, you can throw on a chunky cardigan. Love that. Fabulous. How good's that? Yeah, actually I might try this one on for you ladies. Let's go like. close just so they can see the, um, see the difference in the colour. See, they're two very different mints, but yeah, they go together. Fabulous together. Yes. Yes. They're very different textures. Everything's different about them, but they look classy together. Yeah, I love them. And I think even the pale pink shoes, what would they look like? Oh, yes. I think so. I love Cute, the yeah. pink sneakers. Look at that. This is where you go, you contrast. Even though we're talking tonal, you wouldn't do a black or a green shoe. My goodness, would you ever do that? Never. No, you'd go for something like this. Something totally different. Totally different and a bit pale because I think the paleness of the shoe matches the pale of the outfit. So I think if you had like a pale and a pale, it would be okay. That's the wrong look top. I think you think you wear that's the wrong look top, Cindy. You can wear whatever you want. Yeah, do whatever. Yeah, there's, no, hey, look, there's no rules. We're just giving you some guidelines. It really doesn't matter. It's only our taste anyway. If you don't like our taste, move on. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Just wait for the next thing because it'll be different. In wait till the next three p.m. <laughs> That's, That's right. right. <laughs> okay, put that back. So okay, what's we'll next? So we can probably swap. So if you want to swap over, you could take that one and I'll do this and leave that top on because you can actually wear the shirt under this. In do fact, you think you'll be able to I don't see know, it? I'm just trying to work it out. I don't think you're going to see it enough. I hate to say, you do see it at the back. Look, at the back. But it's I mean, a few inches longer at the back, so you can do that if you want. Or we'll disregard this one altogether. Oh, my arm is getting yeah, I know. You see what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. And it does take, a, take its toll. You can do this look, which is also quite nice and casual. Or I'll take this cardigan away now and put the fur in there because there really is something about adding a fur. Now, we do have a promotion on just today where you get 30% off the furs. This is beautiful and soft and just gorgeous to wear. Just throwing mm. on something like that has totally changed it, but I do this in a casual way. Because Me too, I do a sneaker for sure. You wear your sneaker. If 100%. you do this with heels, for example, oh my goodness, definitely don't. It's not our taste, just don't do it, it's bad taste. Okay, so this looks fantastic with something more casual with a, like a boot or a sneaker. I love that look. Love that. Okay, Roma wants me to put the shirt on. Okay. I wore the right cami today. I knew I'd be trying on. You did know that. And I'll put on the fur. So this, this is your idea, idea of how you can do your outfit. How you can do casual with a fur. Nobody be asking me to do this, but I thought I'd do it anyway. Just do it. You know, it's coming. It's, you know, it's coming. How, how it goes. It was coming. All right. So this is the size ten. Shirt on me. This is my size. I'm always the 10. Now this one doesn't have stretch, but it's really, it's roomy. It's fine. You don't need to, um, you know, worry about size. Go, up or anything. go your size. But again, I always do a bit of a front tuck with this shirt and I love it hanging long at the back. Looks and Faye has long. shown you all, if you wanted to make it a bit tighter and shorter, you just tuck a bit more from the sides into the front. Oh, fabulous. Yeah. And then you've got that little ledge. So you yeah, can do shorter. Shortens the back. But in this situation, I actually really love it long. Yeah, sometimes I love it long too. Just to show people in case they don't. What I did here as well was all up my first sleeves, which I think is very trendy. You don't want to just have them. You've got to wear this sort of thing with attitude and style. And this is the way you wear it. And I'll just pop this on so you guys can see what the colours are like as well. Thanks, Anne. It's a good belt, isn't it? I got it from overseas. We might get it from Otto, we're working on it. Working on similar pretty things. Alright, so gorgeous. this is a great look and I think the thing is that's wrong is my boots. If I yes. had sneakers, yes. this would take it into edgy town and like funky. Look at that. With the sneakers, it makes it edgy town. Fabulous look. For sure, for sure. Shall we swap? You do the fur, I'll do the card making. Love this fur by the way, it really is something special. 
I love doing this for Girl ones jeans. a really casual pair of jeans or better yet, if anyone has the snug slouch pants, which is basically like a classy tracksuit pant, I would do those with a sneaker with the fur. Man, how good is that? Oh, this is like beautiful. this is like that cat, that pet cat you've always wanted to stroke on the couch. You can play with your fur instead of your cat. And I kind of like these minty colours together too, but it's more to show you how the cardi looks. So this is a 10, and I'm usually an 8, so it's a fabulous size. I tend to pull it back so I get that nice um, swing line, that vertical line down the front. But then what I will do with this is roll it up so you can see some of my jumper coming through, or blouse cuffs, or whatever. I actually still like those colours together if you were wearing denim jeans. I know, yeah. yeah. Well, this skirt doesn't quite look right, but... With denim jeans, and we didn't put any jeans here. No, I think it's a look at my jeans. Come here. There we go. There you are. How's that? <gasps> amazing. <laughs> yeah, it was an amazing shot, wasn't it? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> All right, yeah, so here's the fur. That's the card. If you guys want to see us try on anything else, just let us know. And just one more thing. Oh, there's I one thought, one. yes, I thought I we would add the dark green because we don't have, I don't know, we do have sides in this, don't we? We have a few, we have already sold out this one. I think there's no 12s, no 18s, and oh. I think there's only one 14 and one 16 and a couple of 10s. It's just a fabulous look to go the more contrasting shades. You know, when we're saying wear a similar shade or lock it together, this is rather nice. I actually really love that. It's a beautiful class yeah. combination, isn't it? For sure. This Gorgeous. shirt. It's the Amina blouse. If you really, if your size isn't there, you could size down because it's quite, you know, it's quite floaty and loose. And you can kind of do a few things with a shirt that has buttons down the front. You can do one of the half side tucks. That's right. Maybe we should. Oh, do you want to show with that blouse? Well, I can't show with this one. That blouse. Oh, you mean this blouse is what I mean? Yeah. I'm going to quickly show you guys because especially if something feels a bit big for you. Then this is a really great, especially for the shorties. And I know I don't want to focus on giving the sh all the secrets to the shorties, but because we're short, we really know what we're talking about. Well, look, it's not that hard to work out. Just opposite to the tall ladies, so we work figure them both out. Okay, so as you can see, if I wear this shirt, to me, this just like, makes my torso look too long for my legs. So that's why we always do front tucks. So first of all, I'm going to do that just because I like it. Fabulous sleeves, very modern with it sleeve this one okay so the first thing is you can do a very small knot and you know i'm on camera so the pressure's on to do this right <laughs> you get it right first time Gorgeous. all right so that's that right so you can instantly shorten it easily like that you still get the length covering the tushy so you've got your knot and again this can go for the dina blouse the everyday shirt so then i've got it open again the other thing that I really, actually this is my favourite thing to do, and it's phase as well, is the underside, so that, see this is the one that's going over yeah, with the buttons, buttons. Are, the side, the where, side the where the actual are. buttons are attached to the, to the front, I'm going to softly tuck that into the front, Beautiful. blouse it over, and then how classy is that? you can see that I've got a leg and a waist up here, whereas this one's hiding it. And even just thrown over the shoulder like that, is it that yes. so stylish? Rich, rich looking. It is rich looking. Expensive. And if I had a sneaker Classic. on, then oh, this whole yes. look would come together, okay. especially for ISO. a sneaker there. Look at that. Brilliant outfit, ladies. Yeah, really Brilliant. good. Love that. Great. So then, the other thing you can do is you can also do a full front tuck. So I'm just going to pop in the other one. It really kind of depends what kind of a pant you're wearing, I think. But personal favourite at the moment, I change it every year. My personal favourite right exactly. now is this. That's brilliant. Look, for the taller ladies who like doing that little knot, you can also do that over something like the uh, candy that Lauren's wearing. I won't ask her to pull it out. So you've just got the candy shine under there and the knot over you. Okay, there you go. I mean, the colours, it's really obvious what yeah, the colours the colour, are, right? The colour's not right, but if it was tonal, or something a little bit more to your liking, that looks fabulous. <laughs> so you can add the length, yeah. get the whole so, covering So there. you don't feel like you're tall and you're missing out. We like to give you those good tips yeah, as well. Yeah, that's right. Um, so, Roma, are you talking about this cami? Because oh, no, this one. No, no, she said, do you have a green cami? Not in this cami, we don't. Now I'm looking at the next comment, where does that, that shirt have a sheen? No, not really. That shirt is quite, it's fairly matte. It is the soft touch, what we call soft touch. 
It is a bit of a stretchy fabric. It does. It has a, a light sheen, but it's not shiny. No, it's not shiny. It's, it's just a very fabric shine. I would say it's very matte. Yeah, that's right. You get one you're wearing. Maybe you take it up close yeah. while I get myself sorted. A, well, I was going to say, have a look at next to yours. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, you can see. So mine's like shiny, like satin. Whereas this isn't. It's yeah, completely like matte. Satin. Yeah. Yes. Okay. It's just a fabric shine. But it still does have that that it's slight shine. It, it's also actually got that slight dressiness to it, and I think because it's so drapey and a silky feel, it still has a dressy flair. It but does. The right, the right yes. kind of dressy flair. So out of this little group, fabulous. All you want to do is add a gem. But you want to add a gem to all of them anyway, and I'm sure you have them by now. Okay. So you're gonna pop on your jacket. I'm just a bit cold, guys, so I'm just yep. going to put it over the top so I don't have to do my armband. Okay, so, the, so we're finished with the green. So this is the green bundle. So Bron hopefully has popped a link up for you guys if you wanted to shop any of the items in the green bundle. And you know what? If you guys are ever wondering, can I wear this with this, go into our VIP group. We might, If you do it on, on the main page, Faye and I might actually miss it because we have lots of comments happening on these pages and sometimes it can be hard to keep up with them. So if you want to post in our VIP group, tag... Lauren French, Bay Brown, then we'll see it. You and ask us, just go with that. If you don't know how to do that, you just put an at sign, right? An at, at sign, sign and our start, names. start typing yeah. our names. Yeah, exactly how we spell our names, because mm. otherwise we'll go somewhere else. Just looking at the last comment there from Karen, um, what is the best candy to wear if the neckline's a bit plunging? And we do have a lot of those, because people of different heights, and sometimes if we do them too high, they look mumsy and daggy. And you know what, you can use anything. I tend to, oh, I'll show you this way. I tend to wear just a simple basic basic jersey, cami. basic cami. Lauren can even wear something like this. We well, have this is quite low, so though. many camis that are even... Actually, they're coming. They're coming. Don't worry. In a few weeks, you'll see our mm. camis that we've actually made so that you can wear under all these... Oh, yeah, we've got big ones. We've got a yeah. really good one. There are so many shapes with thin straps, thick straps, adjustable straps, whatever. We've got it. Mm. So hang five. And we're also, we're also going to do packs of these jersey camis when we're allowed to make things again, okay? And the jersey, to yet. the jersey cami is really good because it's stretchy and it's tight, so you can actually kind of adjust where you want it to sit if you don't want too much of this. You know what my daughter said to me? She goes, Mummy, why when you go to work you always show this? <laughs> my cleavage, I'm like, sorry, oh. sorry, who's the mum now? Okay, Jackie, the sleeves are very, no, very generous. Show you. And also they're a wee bit stretchy, but they're massive, look. Huge, this is the meant ten. to be very, very loose and baggy, you won't have a problem at all. This is the 10, I guess, and it'd be equivalent to a size 16 to 18 arm if it was just a normal shirt. Yeah, the only place... It's a stylized. You could, you could literally size down two sizes in this. The only place you can't is this button. If you've got boobs that are a size 14 and you're buying a 10, it'll pull. Yeah, you probably have So you just undo it. If you wore a cami under this, you could you buy a 10 if you're a 14 mm. and still look great. You just have to wear that undone. It's you really big. The boobs a bit of room. The only okay. thing is the boobs. Yeah. Because I think when we used to have Louisa doing trials with us, she's breastfeeding at the moment. I think her bust was about a 14. She put on the 10. It fit her beautifully. The only thing was it was just pulling there. And, you know, that's like a common thing. In fact, when we try on things, sometimes we like it tight just there and then you get that little bit of a gap but you obviously have to wear something underneath unless you've got an amazing bra that you want to flash mm -hmm. but most of us don't do that we usually wear a cami i'm assuming they i probably if wouldn't. anyone's going to do it it's going to be her but you, know what do? you could wear a cami a bit like this because i like wearing this cami yes, that's right. and then actually if you put your do you mind putting your jacket on i'll just demonstrate it for you even i like wearing this cami under like the everyday shirt and stuff and then you could just wear a few buttons undone and what you would do is have it buttoned up to there so you get this look like that. And you do that for the blouse. You don't have to do that with the jacket. My daughter would be horrified. That's right. Mum, why are you ah, showing ah, your ah. boobies on screen? <laughs> She's so cute. Well, it's okay. okay. It's better than asking what those lines are around the neck, Nanny, yeah. because they were wrinkles. That's not too good, is it? <laughs> she, asked, she asked Faye what the lines were on her neck. <laughs> she, she did. She did. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> all, all right. right. Well, you all do. Okay. Okay, so, so that's that bundle. Yeah, so we'll move on to the next bundle. I'm assuming we're ready. Oh, we like got... the cow cam and the cow cam is sensational, which is part of this next colour group. Actually, oh, we're doing the pinky colour. Hello, group. my favourite colour. I think we all know that by now. You can actually you? take off your jacket and then make it oh, okay. Is that okay? <laughs> this is a good one. Oh my god. Okay, so I've got it. Oh, well, we're going to start. We should really start. I started with the cam if you're wearing it. But we have started here with the cargo. So the cargo, it's only available in black at the moment. Hang five, 
in, a, in a, some time in the future, maybe a month or so, we do have a different range of cargoes. But for now, this is a gorgeous cargo in a fabulous fabric. Um, yes, suits a long-legged people. And I'm going to say, volume. also, if you're thinking about the cargo, it's been one of our best sellers for the past week. It's only been out a week, but it's not going to hang around long. Mm. So, again, don't hold on for that one. Yeah, but again, I feel like... Yeah, I was going to say, when we say that it's low in stock, it's low in stock. It's actually low in stock. Not pretend low in stock. <laughs> um, also, I actually did the courtesy try on of these today, and I feel like they are too long for me. I'm just going to put it out there. If you're five foot two, I feel like you need a double cuff. If you can't sew or you're not prepared to get them tailored, I've got to laugh hard. at some of these comments from Heidi. <laughs> what her daughter said to her, she used to be pretty when she was younger, <laughs> and number one crinkles. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yes, exactly. We love those. Actually, I think once my daughter did say to my mother-in-law, why is your face crinkled? <laughs> <laughs> so funny, oh my God. Okay, so these pants, look, everyone's got different leg lengths. So aside from me being five foot two, if someone has longer legs than me and they're five foot two, they'll be fine. For me, the perfect height on length on these would have been to double cuff them. I'm only just telling you because no one really wants to bother with returns to do that. But it's sort of hard to stay there because it's just the fabric that's it's there. It's not going to work. You can certainly do that, though, if you want to, or obviously leave them long. So I'm just letting you know if you did want them to sit a bit more cropped, that's the situation there. Look, I'm almost tempted to say you can pull them up. They won't stay up, but if there's a way you can use... Our armbands, arm bands, arm bands. as um, you know, ankle strappers, yeah. whatever they're called. Like you know, when, so. when, you, when you, the old days when men used to ride their bikes in their baggy pants, they used to have like really, um, yeah, my oh, father used to. Have yeah, that. I actually thought the same thing, and I just thought, oh, the ladies would think I'm yeah. cuckoo. No, well, there you go. So I'm saying that I'm being cuckoo. So that might be a way of you doing that, and you can just fold it over the the elastic, the um, the metal in. in oh, well, we've got black, so you wouldn't even see it. Might be a way of getting around it. So, uh, but for the taller, anyone average height and above, or maybe five foot four, you'll be right. Anything and under that, they'll be a bit, wee bit long. Marlene, yeah, you can absolutely fold the waist over. So that's going to help you again. Actually, I don't want to do that. Toe. Yeah, don't just have to watch toe. If you come up too far, you've got a camel toe. So if that doesn't bug mm -hmm. you, you're fine. I might just show you the waist fold because I feel like, that, look, if I was shopping, this would going to be a thing for me. So that's the normal waist. If you wanted to, you could easily do that, and then you're still going to get these little dingle dangles so you still get well, to show that off dingle dangles inside the pant probably i still like them hanging out though yeah so okay. you could easily do that but again it'll lift the crutch up a little bit so there's a little double whammy i do this with a lot of pants actually including my slouch viscose pants i always do that waistband yeah. trick do you i take i do because i'm short you know and sometimes you just need that little bit of extra Us shorties got to improvise extra. don't we <laughs> we've well, got to find all these ways of doing things okay so we're putting that with the cami i'll hold it out just so okay yeah yeah the cami's great because it does have adjustable straps we love this and they're beautifully placed on lauren's shoulder so as she turns around you can see her bra strap make her turn around bra strap's great we did this before for the ladies that weren't around that's so nice. And again, the card with that is so fabulous. Look at that. I know she's got a hanger on her back, but it gives you a bit of an idea. I love the two the two. Oh, look, we match. I never do match that. Okay, so that's one way. But you can also, what I love about this blouse, you can also do that. I'm not quite sure if you get to see the bottom of the coming. The, I'll try it. These are matching fabrics. And what I thought, is if it's not, one's not long enough for you, you can just add a cami underneath. I suppose I should try this before. Yes, you get that little bit of a floaty thing at the bottom there, which is so pretty. It's nice. So if you do want to add a little bit of length, because this blouse, for those of you that want some shorter blouses, this one's a really good one. It's not too long. It's great for skirts. It's great for collots. It's really easy to do a front or a side tuck because you don't have all the volume when it's long. That's right, and we've been asked for the shorter Actually, when skirts come in, we'll need these shorter blouses. That's why we've done them. So that, again, looks fabulous with... Where's the cargo? With that. Mm, the cargo's a great ISO pant. Oh, it looks fantastic. It's, like, really, it's, it's actually smart, but it's not too casual, even though it's casual. I'm going to go the khaki sneakers with this. I went around the other way. Yeah, I love some of great. So nice. Again, these look brilliant with stilettos, points boots amazing but right now we're doing casual with 
with the mm -hmm. sneakers. Yeah, definitely. Just bear in mind, actually, trying it with black stilettos. Oh, I might do that one day. A lot of cargo right. heels. Cargo is dressed up that, a lot. Yeah. Is amazing. That that's the you know the opposite to what we're doing. We're doing casual with dressing, but also because that's casual, you put a, a sexy kind of stiletto with it. Very nice. Now, and the cami is not stretchy, not at all. The cami is. Let me see. No, no. I was going to say it might be coming with a bias. No. Not coming with a bias, so there's no stretch whatsoever. So get your size, and if you have big boobies, go up at least a size. Yeah. I like, I mean, my boobs are not, yeah, they're not generous. Boobs. They're just, you know, they're, they're normal, but they're biggish, and I just got a 10 and it's fine. No, you'd be more than a, a size 10 boob, though. Yeah. Yeah, it's probably my boob. Yeah, no, I want a 10 cami, so it's fine. Yeah. No, actually, I think Lauren measures a 14 boob, but often boobs can be, you know, much more generous than that. But anyway, it gives you some idea yeah. with um, Lauren's size in any case. All right, Cheryl wanted to see the cami on. So this is the cami top. Oh, sorry, the top on. This is, um, looks, looks a bit crinkled, doesn't it? It does. Um, yeah. Untucked. You can see where it lands, obviously. I'm going to instantly do that. Yes, because all of a sudden it looks much more stylish by the time you put the tuck in there. Much more. And I'll just show you with the cuff. And I've also pulled up the sleeves, just so you know, that's the cuff. And again, we've got the double button. So if you want to make the cuff a bit tighter, you can. And I'm just going to, I always do this though. And then I love having oh, yeah, that nice baggy sleeve. Yeah, it gives you that fabulous look. And you wanted to see it with 100%, hard. that looks great. You know what, Very this cool. would also look really good with that collot we showed you at the start, the black collot. That would be awesome. How can I do this with two hands instead of four? There you go. So look, these will all intermix, but we just wanted to keep them in groups for you to, to help you understand how they go. All right, Sylvia, yeah, sure. Pull them all out. You guys are really getting really me out ready every day. Oh, yeah, so that's the camera. Yeah, really cute. I just, personally, I hate this length on me. So don't be put off because I'm not looking that great when I've got no front tuck because I feel like I look just like a weird little... Well, we're both little shorties, man. but we actually have short legs. You know, you get the short torso, long legs, the short legs, longer torso, and the ones that are right in the middle. We're that other version, we're the short leg version. That's why we need heels. For all of you that are like that, you need heels. There you are. Yeah, that's nice. It just gives you a bit of length at the front. Yeah, so if you're the, the type that doesn't want the tough butt, you know what? I'm a tucker. I'm you such a tucker. It's so much more stylish. Why not be a tucker? <laughs> Alright, cool. What's next? Okay. So, we can leave that on for now. But this is again the long jumper. I love it with, I love this combo. I mean, I've got the matching jumper and I think if I wear that cardigan with the matching jumper, to me, it's nowhere near as stylish no as way. this. No way, no way. Yeah, the other two phase top and the cardi, it's a bit matchy poo, a bit like, Boring. a little bit on the dated side, mm. but if you want to look funky town, you want to go for a different kind of pink. Like, how, do I just look so pretty with I this? I mean, the whole thing is just beautiful, with it's it. very pretty. And yes, and you do that with the cargoes and do a side tuck with the cargo if you're going to go with this really long jump. I think it's much nicer than the front tuck, don't you think? 100%. Yeah. And then you've got your pink sneakers. Yeah, you don't cute. have to do pink, but pink looks good, yeah. It's cute. Mm. It's really cute. Love it. Yes, right. I think that's good too. Right. All right. But then as well, we've got a few choices in jackets here. I love this fur because, again, going to send off just off. today, of course. It's got that pink. Pinky brown effect, yeah, so it's, 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 it's called mushroom. We, the tr to me, the true colour's mushroom. I don't know what I called it, or mocha or something I think like we called it mocha. Okay, or well, mocha Super cute, pies. love that. Or cafe latte or something. And with that silky blouse, very dressy, with the jeans, you get that beautiful opposite look, which makes you classy. And again, if you wanted to do the fur over this jumper and hang your jumper out, I'd yeah, still cute. do a front tuck, really have cute. it hanging down, the back, just 100%. so you can see it, the back of it, so smart. Mm. Yeah. I think with the fur, you don't need to, like, I actually prefer... And the sneakers, yeah? Yes, and the sneakers. But I prefer the fur, not warm dressing, even though it would come in very handy when you need it to be dressy, would, obviously. Would, of course. But I actually love this, wearing it with my sneakers, my jeans that are a bit ripped, or my cargoes, and put this on, like, your leather cargoes, something on the real cash side of pants. I'm loving doing the fur. Yes, absolutely. It's that fabulous contrast. Somebody's doing a front tuck on a show, somebody just happened to say, I think it was Karen. Anyway, it was they were obviously watching. They knew how to do it. And they've they been, they've been it on watching. The show first, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I might try on that as well. Sure. It is a very pinkish look, 
but I should maybe I'll show it with this colour just so that you can see that oh, yeah, it right. actually does work with other colours. Definitely. Look, it does. I mean, I was going to pop it on, but no need. I think that this is nice to see that it goes with any other colour, even though it's a beautiful pinky shade. Mm, yeah, it does. It's still very neutral, even though yeah, it throws that undertone. Of pink. That's right. Yeah. What about with the um with the browns? Any of them? Fabulous. It's great. With that. I'll show you with the lemon as well. Beautiful. And the shirt would all hang down below this. That's you know, we should see the back. That's what they're meant to do. And some legs are behind it. So you do a front tuck, probably. With your sneaker. Like that. With oh, your sneaker. That sneaker. Look Don't at that. go wearing heels. No, not with this. You no. Look, you look frumpy. You look like an old lady trying to get dressed up. Really. Well, was I a bit blunt then? Never mind. Really, you don't want to look like that. You Eli look stylish. Elizabeth, I would say the fur is very, very true size. Don't go up a size. Don't go up a size. Really. And I'm not going to say go down a size, but definitely don't go up a size because it'll right. be too big and you don't want to look like a 10-ton Tessie. Yes, that's right. You don't want right. a 10-ton Tessie. <laughs> <laughs> now, Samantha, I'm so pleased you bought that dress. I'm obsessed with it. I wanted to wear it again today. But oh, I had to refer. I said I was going to wear it, then I got two colds, so I wore a jumper instead. I'm, I'm wearing it tomorrow. So I don't I'm wearing it tomorrow. That Bella dress, let me tell you. It's mine tomorrow. Okay, fine. <laughs> fine, fine, fine. And I okay. this. Oh, hang on. The, okay, Joanne's asking will the brown fur work with warm colours? Yes. That is a tongue twister. Yes, yes. it will. It will. Oh, because we can go. That's a warm colour. Pop it on. The other one's cool. Yeah, this I'm is a warm colour. Do we have any more? Oh, I mean, this is a warm colour. You don't want to wear them together. But no, you're not going to wear them. But you should not do that. That's a warm colour too, I guess. Yes, it does. Just trust us, it does. I haven't got enough here to show the warm colour tone, but that's enough. It's very neutral. Very, right. very neutral. I want you to pop this on too. Sure. Because with this group, the brown with the pink is so style elevating, and this is one. This is one of our mark. What is our mark down, isn't it? Yeah, it's on sale. Okay, but it's on sale, so you'll get a bit of a bargain with this. Oh, we'll Got furs. It's a fur. Um, There's so much fur in here. At the so we've yeah. got thirty percent off all sale items too. So this is just, I don't know what price it comes down to. I didn't bring my clipboard in today, but what but I know it's is it's cheap and it's <laughs> fabulous with the pink. But it also actually now that I've said looks fabulous with the pink, it also looks good with. I even like hanging out. The back. I know, I love that look. I mean, does it, yeah, it looks stylish. Cute, yeah? Yeah. It looks just cool. That's it. It's and that's with the mint, which I love too. Oh, so nice. So the brown is a really classic colour. Don't think you just always need to wear your black jacket or black that goes with everything because if you wear it right, everything goes with the right colour, you know? That's right. It's gorgeous. Yeah, that's right. So I think we've done that one now. Do we need to try anything else in that group, ladies? I think we're done with this group. Yes, and the thing is not the first. And what about in the next? Yeah, I know, so pretty. Like, like that, that look great, yeah? Yeah. That, that. Yeah, you can put the car oh, on the cargo. Look at that. How fabulous for those sneakers too. Actually, I'll pop this jacket on with my outfit too, just to give you a bit of a look. It's a size 8, ladies, so it's my size, so you can see the actual size. Lauren will probably normally wear the 10, but she did get away with the 8. But yeah, I I'm not fine size. in the 8 on that, I've got to say. I'm just going to take this off. Some of them, I think we're doing a Facebook mark. Marcus is explicit Ooh, again. How amazing. Looks Does this awesome look this outfit? outfit. I think you know what? That. I was thinking my outfit wasn't good enough for you today. But I think I've just nailed it. Yeah. Totally. I've got to say, I've nailed it. I've just come up close because I think it's pretty funky. I'm not even going to roll up the sleeves. I think they look pretty cool down here. Look at that. Turn around. Oh, I think this is the way to go. I love that. I should have thought of this before. So nice with this skirt. It's my, I don't know what the skirt is. The Miracle it's Skirt. Miracle Skirt has a beautiful sort of... Does look awesome. It's sort of subtle print on it. Very really subtle. awesome. Love that. It looks oh, really yes. good. Classic. Really good. I think Ooh. the brown. Faye's got like a little bit of brown in her skirt. It's like a bronzy sheen. It's like a print on top. It's a foil print. But it looks it's so good with the brown. Maybe the lighting this way. I don't know if you can see it, ladies. Get my booty out. No, can't see it, I don't think. Anyway, <laughs> you have to trust us on that that it does have a print. If you go to my website, you'll see it much closer. Though. Yeah, I call this print one of those prints that are not, is not a print, which is what I like to wear because being petite, we can't, I mean, you can't overdo prints because they, you know, drown you. So something subtle like this, in fact, we should do a bit on how to wear prints. Maybe when summer comes on, we'll tell you because there is a knack to wearing prints as well. Um, and for me, I need to do subtle or very specific like animal stripes, you know, something like this. But we'll give you more information when we do that bit. Definitely. Okay, so this is gorgeous. So... 
Did you try one? Yeah, yes, you did. Beautiful. All right, so that was our pink, our pink. pink bundle. So it's really easy to see all the different pinks that can go together. And we have such a big range of pinks at the moment that so many of them do go. But if you're ever unsure, you can just ask. That's right, yes. Okay, so and lastly, last group. we have our blues. Woohoo! We're hoping we cover everybody. I mean, there's two cools here, sort of cool and warm and warm. So we kind of covered everybody. There's a little bit of warmth in this group as well. We're starting with our new pot, well, new pot of pan. We were lucky to find a box of these, weren't we? We were. How yeah. did we escape this one? I know they're on. Well, they're only on sale because we've found an old box and they've just they've got. A, we need space. We've got lots of things coming. Is this one of the recycled from um, no. bottles? No. No. It looks no. very much it's like last year. Now, at the time I last checked, um, we only had one size twelve, no size tens, and only a few of every oh, other size. Oh, there we go. It's got a pattern through it. Very subtle charcoal and black this is one of those really great examples of a really really neutral print so it's kind of yes, like a skirt but different exactly yes, it kind of throws the odd little bit of navy looking i guess so doesn't it rather charcoal? than charcoal do you think charcoal? Charcoal? okay so it depends on which oh, light you're looking it doesn't really matter what your eye is probably yeah it's yes. very very neutral so these are now on sale and you get a further 30 percent off dare i say by the time this Live has finished. I think they will be very close yeah. to being gone. So I if you think, like them, jump yeah, on just it. Just jump on it, and it's a perfect fit. Yeah. It's our benefit in the ponty. Suits everybody. It's got long legs. You don't have to worry about the legs if you're short. You know how to cuff it up. I showed you yesterday. Um, so just get onto it. It's a perfect size. Wear your size. Don't double down. No, no normal size. Just go for it. Make it real simple, and you'll love it. Normal size. And Heidi, I just saw that you um, it went very quickly. I don't exactly know what the question was, but the leatherette tube skirt. In a 10, yes, it's completely sold out. I have searched high and low for another customer. There's definitely none. We but can, look, I, can I just say, yeah. before you keep going, I tried on the 12 for this very reason because the girls said they'd run out of 10 and the 12 was okay on me. I just prefer it a bit tighter. So you can actually go the 12 if you're a 10. I'm an 8, don't forget. Yeah, okay. Faye's an 8 and Faye actually bought the 10 and she wears and it. I didn't, and I didn't alter mm -hmm. it. Okay. Yeah, if you're really so wanted. I reckon the tens can easily go for the twelves, but that doesn't mean everybody needs to size them up. I'm just saying there's not a size left, you'll definitely get away with it and you'll like it. Yeah, definitely. But go your size yeah. otherwise. And in the meantime, because we cannot do any manufacturing mm -hmm. until we can manufacture again, we will not be making more yeah. because we're not allowed to. So annoying because we've got some beautiful colours coming, but we can't even talk about it. We'll get you too excited and we can't give it to you yet. That's right. <sighs> Yep. Okay, so, so we're all well behaved and coronavirus goes away. We're not making anything. Okay, so what pants are best in size 10 for shorties who really like a slim tight fit? Don't, okay, I've got the perfect dance. Oh, I was going to say. Oh, oh, what are you going no, to say? No, I was just going to say, if you like a slim tight leg, go with any of our Bengalin zippy pants. And you know what, Karen? We have so many dirt cheap right now because we've only got the odd size 8 and 10 left. So if, you're, if you are at 8 slash 10... This is your chance to really get some bargains. They're super tight, they're super slim, and they're not long. They're actually, Faye doesn't even alter hers. She's five foot. Just have that zip undone. You can wear them undone with flats. It's not a big deal. They look really cute. Jump on them. Actually, for our eight and ten ladies, there is a group that I, we found again in a box because of all this mix-up with COVID. It's been very stressful for, for John, mm -hmm. my hubby and, and Lauren's dad, to get the warehouse organised to make sure that nothing gets lost, but he's found a whole lot of Benny pants and they're a bargain price and there's a lot left over, so they'll be super cheap for you in the eights and tens. So look out for those and they'll be right for you because they're all that Benny shape. Yeah, Is yeah. That right? And in our emails lately, we've been able to offer you shop by size. So in the bottom of a lot of your emails, if you go to that, that area, it'll say, you know, 30% off sale items, shop by size. If you click on the size eights and the tens, it will actually show you everything available just in that size because when they get to sale, there's a lot of sizes missing, so you don't want to waste time clicking into everything. So jump on that. But the zippy pant is great, the Benny pant is great, the miracle pant is great, Karen. They're probably yes. three you can start with. That's right, yeah. yeah. I guess what might be big, big on you will be the jean shape. Anything yeah, the pull, jean? On, the pull on jean. It'll That's what you call it. Not, it's nothing to do with denim, it's just the, the leg yes, shape. It's shape. Sort of called jean, yeah. Okay. So, so these are the Benny. These are the Benny. These will fit. They'll just be long. Yeah, they're long. Yeah, but you can always cut them. Yeah. All right, what's up next? Oh, okay. So, this is the same shape as the jumper I'm wearing, ladies, but it's in this beautiful woolly look. This does have a bit of wool content, and some of you have asked. I've worn this, and I don't get itchy, and my skin's very sensitive, so it's just a tiny bit of wool, so you may get away with it. 
All right, so we've so got our panther throws the odd bit of navy, in my opinion. They saw it as grey, but it's sort of a mixture oh, between the two. It's cool. You know, and it's it cool. probably depends what you wear with it. It's going to go more so. that way as well. Okay, then we've so got the blue jumper. jumper. Now, what, what were you what thinking about the bird, next? The bird over the top, the bird the vest, sorry. The vest or the fur, because it's got these sleeves. I couldn't find the nice with the vest. And now, just, this vest only has 10s and 12s left. We do have some other colours, though. I haven't checked on those sizes. There's a really neutral one. And then you saw the brown one earlier. Yeah, it just changes the look of that. I love that. It's so nice. That with sneakers is cool. Oh, I, I think know. adding that fur vest, like the outfit is mm. just... And yeah. again, this one's marked down as well now. Oh, so yeah, it is. It's a promotion, extra 30% off on whatever the price is you're yeah, liking. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. So um, I feel like with the blue jumper and the pant, like, it's, a, it's nothing wrong with the outfit, but it's not it's not style. No, it's not. Wow, as soon as you put the fur vest over, all of a sudden we're being seen. Yeah, being seen. And you've elevated your look, which is what we're talking about today, how to elevate that look for you. So that's a great combo. Yes. Now, if you want to, under this jumper, you can you, wear a shirt. You can wear a shirt, can't yeah. you? So let's do, take the vest off. I think it's going to be too much. So if you want to add a little bit of length to this jumper, then all you need to do is pop one of our Dina blouses, which is quite long, underneath. Now you can't, see, can't actually, you know what you do, you flip it over, flip the back side, then I can see the print. So you get to see that from the back. Really nice. And, you, and your legs. Look at that. And that's a that's great so option cool. if you don't want a front tuck. And then what you want to do if you're really cold, can you hang on to that too? This is where you put on your blue coat. I don't know how many of these are left, but look at that. It gives you a fabulous look. Again, that elongated look, very stylish. And this is warm as warm because it's stretchy. So nice and stretchy fur. Don't know if we need to show anybody up front here. Maybe we will just so that you can see everything. Go. So then if you wanted to, you could even, hang on, leave that jacket out. Yep. You could put this. Oh, yes, of course. Just over the blouse. And the pant. You're thinking of a different pant. Oh, so nice. Just like this. Love it. Really simple. I love the tonal of the print oh, and that the, looks really and the smart. Smart. Looks great. Gorgeous. Yeah. So and when it does get a bit warmer and you don't want to do a jumper underneath, then you can just go for your blouse. And this is like a cardigan. That's right. And when you get that strong heating wherever you go, if you're at work or something, you can take this off and go outside when you leave to go home and put that on and you're nice and warm. Right. Yeah. So don't forget, that jacket is on sale. I don't have my clipboard, so I don't actually know the price, but you will get an extra 30% off whatever the sale price is. I have no idea. I'm going to say off the top of my head, it's going to be lower than half price. Um, yeah, you think but so. that's a total guess, so yeah. don't get mad if I'm wrong. <laughs> so I'll put that there, and I thought we'd throw the vest over that. It's very light, but it's a bit of a different look, the spot and the stripe, I thought, look. Quite classy, don't you think? We are like that. Actually, in this situation, I think I prefer it with a jean. Yeah, denim jean. That's right. You need the denim jean for all these. But I do like it with the other one. I think you're right. The denim jean looks really smart. I think you just need that little really bit gorgeous. more white. So yeah. if you've got your denim jean, your everyday shirt, which you know is one of our favourites, we're mm. always talking about it. Yes. And I do so like nice. it with the white vest. It's very unexpected. Well, that's right. Very unexpected. But you can easily put on the blue jacket, or I really love, I'll show you the next outfit. Oh yeah, I actually See, like that. Right, and that with denim jeans as well, you think? So smart, yes, so smart. But the black pant, I think, kills it when we do, it doesn't kill it, it's a, a killer. It's a winner. A winner, a winner killer, you know what I mean? Opposite to what the word actually means, one of those things. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I love these two together. This, this is the ultimate time last I know, my favourite combo, these two together. Classy. Love and let me tell you, ladies, if you look good with grey hair, going grey, thinking about it, got the odd grey bit in your hair, this outfit is for you. It is beautiful. I'm getting a few grey hairs and I'm thinking, yeah, I should have got this. Gorgeous, gorgeous combo. Love that. And also, if you didn't want to wear a dark pant, you could actually wear a lighter coloured denim. You could do something like I'm wearing, or if you've even got the lighter again, I've seen someone wear this exact outfit. Oh my God, she looks so amazing. So definitely, if you've got either this shirt or this jacket, you've got to get that other piece. Jane, you can definitely go down the size in the vest. Go to the 12, you'll be fine. Because you don't want it to join up anywhere near your boobies anyway. You've got to have that space. So anyone can go down the size in the vest. If there's a sure. short size. For sure. Don't go up, whatever you do. Anyway, this is great. I love it. Love you that too. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Maybe even the cargo. Even a look with the cargo, that's quite smart. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's cool. And a pair of pink sneakers or so no, cool. the car pink sneakers. And I mean inside. this is the kind of outfit you can literally oh, lounge at home in. It's so easy because the shirt's just so oversized, it doesn't matter about the size. The car key sneakers just step it off beautifully, love it. 
Angela, I think yeah, we don't. We don't. Ooh, I'm, you know no. what they did? I actually had a spare behind my table, and they've taken it. They've taken it. So I can't even give you my skirt because this one's been. I'm on my body too often. I definitely wouldn't sell you mine anyway. Oh, I'm so anyway. sorry, no. So sorry. Yeah, we don't have that skirt. We've had a lot of people wanting size 10 skirts, yeah, which is very. You know what? I reckon in this you could probably go the 12. It's pretty firm, but it's. it's That's what yeah. I mean. If you don't mind it being just not as tight as I'm wearing, I think you can go the 12, ladies. Think about that. Mm -hmm. um, it won't be as tight, okay? All right, I'm going to quickly try on the vest for Jane. Sure. Just to show you, Jane, because no, I don't think it's going to be too tight in the back. No, I don't think so. Because it's very roomy. Don't worry, it can be because of the big armholes. Christine, the pale blue blouse is, is amazing. All right, so this is the vest on me. Now, you can see there is a lot of room back here. Okay, I pinched out. And I'm going to put my hands in the pocket so you can this see where one, the sides are. This is one size. Just, turn, just go up closer. And turn side on. I pinched out one size and that's two sizes. So you can see it makes no difference to the to this part at all. You'll be right. You, you'll be safe. It's got a lot of coverage. Yeah, I think you'll be safe. safe. And the most important thing is that we definitely don't want anyone to size up because their size isn't available because you don't want it to look like this because you look like a, a, you're going deer hunting. That's right. You need to you have need to open, like that. sort of semi off, you know, coming off your shoulder like this. Mm. You'll be fine, Jane, I promise. And um, yes, all the all the um, vests are the same length. I'll pop on the other colour as well because this fur is much flatter than the brown. And then there's also a third colour. I think it's called natural or something along those yeah, lines. It's more of a stripy brown shade. Yes, and that's even flatter again. So the, this one now that I'm putting on is the sort of the the um, furriest. <laughs> that's so the, the, it's furriest. the you know the more the bulkiest, bulkiest bit in the bulkiest, bulkiest, that's it. Yeah, both size 10 vests at the moment that Lauren has tried. I personally am in love with this one. I've got the white one already from last year. So well, this is usual. Better, but this one actually is I don't cool. even mind it with a cami, Lauren. What do you think? I do like it with a cami. Something Again, that very unexpected look, isn't it? Mm. Classy. Really I think it's classy. classy. Yeah, mm. totally. And if you did it with something like a galosh... Can, can I just say something? Excuse me, those I've got the hiccups. I just have to say that. If anyone hears this funny sound, I wonder what it is. I'm sorry, I've never had the hiccups live before. So now that I've said that loud, they're probably gone. Okay. Thank I'm you. Say, you didn't even have to say it. I didn't have to say it, but if I didn't say it, I probably would have been hiccups on in the, the day home. <laughs> All right, now does anyone want me to try anything else on while I am half in yes, the mood? That's right, we're half here. Do I need it? Off. Anything else? Do I need yes, it? Do I need it? Anyway. What about well, maybe this. Yeah, try that one on. I mean, you've probably not seen me 500 times in this shirt because... What about the cape? Maybe I'll try on the cape. Alright, so this is the Oops. shirt. I'm going to undo <laughs> that one. <laughs> Just see what I did. I just swung it around and I missed it. My shoulder. Crazy down here. Someone, here someone help me get dressed. <laughs>
soon as you can. Super stretchy, you can. Yeah, it's actually, very stretchy. can I say that blue fluffy one? Personally, oh, hang on, what's this? Oh no, I'm trying the wrong thing. Yeah, you are. This one's striped. Personally, I I would like a few sizes down in that cardigan. It does fit, but I think it looks better a bit tight. Yeah, I like it a bit tight too. And I, I think, think you need to. And I think as well because the fabric is so stretchy, it's very unexpected the amount of stretch. It's literally super duper stretchy. You've just got that room. Hang okay, on, I'll do it and do this button. Yeah, should, actually, you should try on the. Kind of um, this with this shirt that I'm trying on now, the everyday. The, so the coat was a size ten. Um, Jackie, again. I think you, that was you who asked. It's just disappeared before I could see. Now this. The shirt, this shirt, definitely take your normal size. I mean, you could size down a whole bunch of sizes. If you, you wouldn't even know the difference. Okay, just so buy what you want, but if you're confused, get your size. Yeah, but you can go down one and even two because it will stretch. No, no, there's one about the shirt. Oh, okay. The shirt won't stretch, but you can totally. This is an eight on Laura. She's wearing an eight. Is it an eight? That's an eight. I just saw the label. Really? Yeah. So you can see how big it is. Like so it's huge. You shouldn't have to be concerned about ladies that just put your arm up and come back a bit. I don't know if they, we can see. Is this? So if you have a big arm just there, I mean, and that's a lot, honestly a lot of room. That's almost down to my elbow. It's a lot of room. But if that that's the only place where it can be tight, the rest can be any size. Yeah. So if you, this is the only place. But you could easily size down two two sizes. By the way, stripes are really big for next summer, I'm just saying. Just I'm going to try that, that, that Cardi on in a sec. Um, Which one? Catherine or Cheryl or some, someone starting with a C. I won't forget it. Yeah, yeah. nice. Yeah, I've got to yeah, sort myself the out. Gorgeous. Yes, beautiful. Oh my God, it's so nice. So stylish. Very Parisienne, again. See, it's that unexpected, like, you just throw it together. That's something the French girls do all the time. Alright, I'm trying on Mania now. Yes, the teal, the teal dolman. Is that the oh, this is it. One. Yes, it does. It does very nicely. I don't know how much overhang you're going to get at the bottom. I'm going to untuck it so you guys can see the lengths. Mm. It does have a bit at the back. At the oh. back it does, but not really at the front. I mean, but if you did front tuck, you'd probably I'd get away with it. something. Yeah. And you have a bit of style the way you wear it. I think you'd get away with it like that nicely. That's stylish. Mm. I think that works. You like? Not like. Yeah, I like. Yeah. Yeah. Um, all right, the Sparkle Cardi, I'm going to put that on now. There you are. Now, this one is true to size, but it is really stretchy. So if you have to, you can size down, but if your size is there, there's no point. No, because I'll tell you why. Because, because we designed it a certain way. This you know, is the size squeeze 10. squeeze into something if you don't have to. You definitely fit into it. In fact, you could probably go up two or three sizes, but it would be very tight then and clingy. Down. If you don't like that clingy look, go your size. Yeah, and you know what? No one wants a bit of back cling. That's what I didn't like. Do you know what I mean? Going to a different size for that back. Yeah. Okay, so did Lauren mention you can size down on a long cardigan? Uh, Janine, you can, but the, it's not necessary no, no. unless your size isn't there. Yes, you I, could. What you'll find is that it'll just end up being a little bit more grippy. If you don't mind that, you can go down a size. If there's no size left, you can certainly go that way. But we prefer it to actual size because, I'll just show everybody, it is super duper stretchy. You see, it keeps on gro growing. I'll right, we'll do it down here, I'm not quite sure if you've got that on camera. So you can wear it any old way, but we prefer it the right mm -hmm. size if it's there. The only place that is fitted is the arms, and they're so stretchy it doesn't matter anyway. That's right. It will fit yeah. anyway, it's a matter of how, of how you like it. But if you're going to wear shape wear, you can easily go down a size because then it's going to, you know, show off a beautiful figure under there. Mm -hmm. And that would be fantastic if you did that. But we always, in, gen in general, we recommend the size that's there. I think Sorry, so. true size. I think it's more, always go your normal size and then ask the question if your size isn't there. Yeah, that's and right. Then, Otherwise you'd go your size. Yeah, our customer care team can always help you with that as well. Um, oh my God, if someone wore that blue jacket, this one's yes, that's Aldi. right, Ron. Go to Aldi. You go, girl. Get your stuff for Aldi. I think you'd look amazing. Now, can I actually get my jacket back on everybody? Well, maybe. Thank you. All right, I think we're done.
Okay, I think we're finished and I quite enjoyed just that. just the that baby nice. wheel. That's right. Yeah, I think it's time so for I us think to the baby, the baby, baby comes back. They're done their babysitting duties, yeah. <laughs> All right, well, amazing, okay. guys. Thanks so, so much. I hope you enjoyed it and we'll see you tomorrow at three. No idea. We'll no. Surprise. It's a wild card. Wild card for tomorrow. And don't forget all our fur stuff, fur styles, fur stuff, mm -hmm. whatever, to make it more glamorous, or our fur collection. That's nice. Is 30% um, off until midday tomorrow for afterpay day. So indulge. That's right, indulge because it will only be for 24 hours and that's it. That's okay, it. ladies. Bye. So